first thing you're going to want to do is warm the car up for a few minutes. It'll make the oil flow easier. And then before you take the oil drain plug out, go ahead and take the cap off of the filler filler cap and that'll make it drain, that'll make it flow out easier. The next step is to find the oil drain plug underneath. It's a size 15 bolt down here and we are using an electric ratchet to go ahead and spin it off. We got our oil drain, our oil pan right here. Once all the oil has come out, go ahead and put your drain plug back in. And you've got a copper crush washer in there. So you want to you want to tighten it enough to squeeze that crush washer just a little bit so that you don't get any oil leaks. Okay, and once we put the oil drain plug back, we took a set of channel locks and we grabbed onto our oil filter right here and we twist it loose and then you take the oil filter off. Okay, before we put the new oil filter on, a couple things to know is first, you wanna put oil on this O-ring before you screw it on. And then the second thing is that you only wanna use, you only wanna screw this on hand tight. Don't use any tools or wrenches or channel locks or anything, hand tight only. All right, and the final thing to do is to go ahead and fill it up. This thing takes six quarts but once you put your oil in, you still want to go ahead and take your dipstick and, and check and make sure.